Right, everybody. Just put, just prove something to you. All right, big old boil. Still burning away. Mad dog jewels. Awfully, they're cold water. Four of them. All right. Just because I can only go so long on this, and I can't get it on YouTube. Just to prove a point. Big golden boy. Remember what I said? Roaring bubbles, no tummy troubles. Okay. So it's not like I fancy the man or whatever. Right, I respect the man. I think his kit, if you're into this outside block, whether it be camping, solo camping, bus crafting, training, whatever you want to call it, you're going to need to boil water at some stage of the game. You need to look after yourself. His kit, Mad Dog Survival kit, is a kind of kit that you buy and you put in your kit and you don't have to worry about it because you know it's going to work. All right? I wouldn't recommend anything. I don't like recommending anything at all. I use his kit because it's good kit and it works, right? Buy a couple, play with the couple, learn what they're all about, put them in your kit. Keep yourself safe. All right? Okay. Andy knows, my dog knows, right? I won't give any BS on these. If his kit doesn't work, I'll say, look, that's not working. Right? If his kit's good work, I'll keep going on and on about it. I'll go on and on about that kit all day long, I will. Alright? They just burn themselves out there, have they? There you go. Possibly didn't need four. Could have possibly done that with three in a bit. You make that out there? Out there. No, it's just one of those little, uh, you know, those little smaller twig stoves, right? So, what it took a while, right? But I set it up like that purposely so it would hit some of the wind, would hit it, you know what I mean? I'm not going to make it easy. So I reckon if you're going to do that, which is not recommended to use my dog juices for boiling water, because they're not made for that. They're made for getting your fire, fire started. But if you were in a pickle, and you did have four or five of them in your kit, three of them, used to get you somewhere there. Hey, try to carry things that got more than one use. I reckon if you were going to do that, like I say, so either get it a bit more windproof than I had it there, because I was only testing them for you, or dig a little divot in the ground. Put, you know, make sure you've got air coming in and going out. Put your cup under that, get it out the wind. But you saw the flame size, saw how long it lasted. Impressive kit, isn't it? Yeah, go and have a look at these stuff, man. And for the money you're going to be paying for them, it's a, it's a no-brainer, man. It's a no-brainer. And uh, sooty, right? It is sooty, but it's, like I say, they're not meant for that. They're not meant for that. So it's just like. Put you straight on things. Really good bits of kit. Really good bit of kit. Okay, so just thought I'd bring you back there because prove a point, mate, you know what I mean? Uh yeah, worth it. Not recommended though, that's not what they're for. That's not what they're for. But uh do you know what I'm going to have to do now, Andy, right? 
time they burn between these are the newer ones and I've got some older ones there see which ones burn the longest or have you done that do you know what I mean maybe they burn longer older than the, I don't know I don't know but just to prove a point that it can't be done that was half a litre okay cracking kit by a cracking block honest well According to that that dog, I wonder if, I wonder who got more injections, the dog or Andy? I reckon the dog probably got more injections afterwards than Andy did. Cheers, mate.